Hello everyone. Last week I presented to you my trading plan based on the Canadian dollar Swiss franc. And uh, today I would like to make a recap on uh, what happened on this plan, how the plan developed so far, did we have any opportunities to enter and what are my future predictions for it. So first of all, what you see on your screens now is the plan itself posted on the platform TradingView. A few words about the plan. Uh, right here, uh, where the plan was posted, the price was standing inside of a daily resistance area. Uh, with the blue lines, uh, we have marked this uh, small sort of consolidation or range on the H4 here, which I expected to be uh, the last place the price will go and from there it might uh, drop. At least that was uh, my opinion on this pair. Uh, another thing to mention is that here, uh, as you can see, uh, I have marked the uptrend with a trend line and uh, I have also closed the current tops, uh, which are still uh, higher, but with a sort of declining. Uh, this formed this triangle, so my expectations were for the price to bounce of this area, probably break the triangle and continue down, uh, where our long-term target was this green area, which was our first daily support. And then we had a second target over here, which was the second daily support. Now, let's see how the plan developed. As you can see, uh, shortly after I posted the plan, we had a break of that triangle. Uh, after that, a small retracement, after which the price uh, moved a little bit down, uh, but I have decided not to post a uh, life signal here because this uh, bottom was not broken uh, after which we saw a huge pump in the price uh, reaching a little bit actually outside of uh, this resistance area we marked here we uh, the price formed a small square as you can see and after that uh, we so a drop below again that uh, resistance area. Now this is the live chart, again the H4. And I'm still inclined to sell the pair. Uh, let's just check on the daily. I'll tell you my future predictions for it. As you can see here, it went a little bit above this daily resistance, but was quickly pushed down inside and below it after that. Uh, so on the H4, uh, my expectations are for the price to uh, fail of breaking again above this uh, line here. As you can see, we had a stop there, actually. Let me just uh, draw on it right here. As you can see, uh, when it started going down, it stopped for a while here, then broke uh, this line, <coughs> this level, uh, went back up to it, stopped on it again and went down. So at this point, even if we see a retracement to that level, I believe it will hold and a new uh, wave down will begin, probably to somewhere here at least. Uh, why here? It is marked by this area here, which is a small uh, support for the M30 trends. Uh, so, uh, where would I look for entries? This would be either here, or if it doesn't uh, retrace this up there, I would wait for a break of this a line, as you can see it bounced from it again, here. So a break of this line would mean a continuation down to here, then maybe a small correction up and a new wave down. 
this is my uh, future prediction on this pair. I'll continue monitoring it and I will update you with the live sign if I see a good opportunity. Uh, the live sign will be posted on Twitter but also in our new Telegram channel where we already posted two sign today. So join uh, so you don't miss out. I wish everyone a profitable week. My other plan is already online. Check it and let's make profits together. Bye-bye.